Our study was designed to try to see if we could prevent nausea and vomiting in patients getting highly emetogenic chemotherapy. And so we added olanzapine to a standard anti-emetic regimen and compared it with a placebo plus the same anti-emetic regimen to see if olanzapine would be effective in preventing nausea. And this was done in the Alliance Clinical Oncology Trial, and we had approximately 200 patients in each arm. And the result was that the olanzapine plus the standard antiemetics was significantly better than the placebo arm plus standard antiemetics in preventing both nausea and emesis. This was the first study that used nausea as a primary endpoint, and it was highly significant in preventing nausea and vomiting in patients receiving highly imagined chemotherapy. And so, based on this phase three randomized uh, double-blind study, I believe olanzapine use is, uh, the study is, a, is changing to change clinical practice and olanzapine, I think, should be used now in patients getting highly imaginative chemotherapy along with a standard anti-emetic regimen in order to prevent nausea and emesis.